It's enrollment time at ONW, and students are trying to decide which classes will be most beneficial for their education. Todd Dane, a counselor here at ONW, gives insight on how to plan for a college education. You start with a career, a specific career choice, and then you build your college educational plan behind that. And depending on what your college educational plan is, then you set your high school education piece. Dane gives advice on how to prepare for honors and AP classes. A thought process to kind of go into your preparation for a weighted class, an honors or an AP class, pre-AP class. The best advice is to go talk to that teacher. Talk to your current teacher in that subject area and then go talk to the teacher of that AP class or that honors class. Angie Powers, an English teacher at ONW, talks about how AP classes can influence your college career. The students that take AP classes many times will be able to get credit via the AP exams. So when you get to college, what that could mean is maybe you graduate in four years still, but you're able to do a year abroad and still graduate in four years. Or maybe you can graduate early, or maybe you can graduate in four years and take on a minor that you wouldn't be able to take on. This has been Emma Johnson for ONW Now. Now back to the desk.